नमस्कार करुणा राय जी नमस्ते सर नमस्ते तो नमः एक संपूर्ण नाम भी भागक जो नी नेक बंडल जो तो अन्य व्यक्ति हर में अंग्रेजी नाम सुनो होने कायो अथवा कमे होला तो सेले को मेरे राष्ट्र ले समान कर दे अपने प्रश्न कुत्तर अपने राष्ट्र भाषा में दीना चाहन जो
entertain people with my art when they are frustrated with their busy schedule. And I think it is also good for physical and mental health. It is also my passion. Thank you. Which needs? How do you identify yourself? First of all, thank you for the question, sir. I identify myself by giving my introduction and telling how good am I at dancing and at studies. Thank you. Change your guns into cans and make your dreams into plans. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Introducing myself, Promisa Rai. I'm a loving old girl who loves to dance and sing all the way from Dolahiti Lalitpur. My, I studied in grade 7, now I'm promoted to grade 8. My contestant number is 53. I'm currently taking my education from Anadwadi School. My aim is to be a successful doctor and a social worker because I want to have poor, needy and who, who don't have a leg, who, who much have less than me. Thank you and have a great afternoon ahead. Contestant number 53, Pramisa Rai, Munsa, Mahala Koshin Raki Dinona Kulagi, Ma Asal Adikari Zula on the road for the soup. Hello, Pramisa. Hi, sir. How are you? Fine, sir. Are you confident enough to answer my question? Yes, sir. Okay, so the question is In your view, what is more important? It is brain or heart, and why? The Paiko Bicharma Savanda Mahatapurna demands Hoki Hirda Kino. First of all, thank you for your question, sir. I'm honored to answer your question. In my view, both are important, brain and heart. But I think brain, heart is most important because it has just one step, one just right to do, and that is to pump blood. And I, I think it's pretty amazing in its quite a whole way because it never stops to beat when we, when we run, walk, sleep, or etc. But it keeps beating at any time. Uh, but it's uh, amazing. Uh, it, it keeps beating for hundreds of years in uh, the time. Thank you and have a wonderful day ahead. Winning should not be our target, but giving our best should be our target. Only the winner would not be praised, but the one who gives his best would also be praised. Namaste, good afternoon, Seva, to all the guests, panel of judges, all the audience presented here, and one and only my competitors, contestants. Knowing you all about me, my name is Aishma Rai, and I live in Goshala, Kathmandu. Hello, oh, Ayushma, my question is Prakankura In your opinion, what are the qualities that are required to be a rising star? Nepali Pani Sotho Barsa? Of course, ma'am. Okay. Tapaiko Bicharma, rising star Barna Kulagi, Kya Gunhunu Barsa? First of all, thank you for the question, ma'am. I'm honored to answer your question. First of all, for being a rising star, um, the person who would be the rising star should be confident. All-rounder should have good manners and good habits. He, sh he or she should not be shy or nervous to show their hidden talent in front of huge mass. And he or she should be, uh, he, sh he or she, she should be confident to show their hidden talent in front of huge mass. Thank you. Hello and good afternoon, everyone. It's me, Samriti Pakul, all the way from Kattagar Bhaktapur, representing. Rosebud School. My contestant number is 22. My aim is to be a doctor. Thank you. My mother brought it from India. Really? Wow. <laughs> As Mahatma Gandhi said, be the change that you want to see in the world. You must stand how I want. Smriti Smagiri, all the way from Kathmandu. I'm contestant number 24. My school name is Bebron National School. My hobbies are dancing, reading, and writing. My aim is to be a social worker because I want to help needy and underprivileged people. Thank you and have a great day. If you won the competition today, whom will you give the information first and why? First of all, thank you for the question, sir. And the answer goes like this. If I won the competition today, I'll give information to my parents because they have always supported me and believed in me. Thank you. Woo! Learning today for a better tomorrow. Namaste Nepal. In
introducing myself, Sohan Razanari, all the way from Tahajal Kathmandu. I am from grade 4 from United School, Imadu Lalpur. I am contestant number 25. My hobbies are to draw and to read books. Although my ambition in my life is to become a scientist in the future. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Dressing myself, that's a manga. All the way from Nakhun, Laripur. I'm contestant number 43. And I am... <laughs> I'm contestant number 43. And I'm 11 years old. I'm straight of the Studies High School. And I'm a girl who wants to be a successful dancer. Because I want to teach the pearl children who wants to dance and make them perfect. Thank you. Have a wonderful day. Thank you, contestant number 43, Nensa Molla Muncha. Wahala Kosh Mraki Din Hona Kulagi. Ma Prabhisha Adhikari Zubla Ondi Rod Kortasu. Nensha, hello. Hello, ma'am. You got a very commanding voice. Thank you, ma'am. Uh, so, my question for you today is, how do you define mother? Kapai Ama Bhanne Shabda Lai Kasari Parivashi Kuru Muncha. First of all, thank you for the question, ma'am. to ours and who gave all opportunity to come in such a program. Thank you. Have a wonderful day. My aim is to be an engineer because I want to build strong houses to poor people to protect them from strong earthquake and many natural calamities. Contestant number 73, Rosa Adhikari Mancha, and I'm going to ask you a question about this question. Good afternoon, Rosa. Good afternoon, ma'am. My name is Rosa Adhikari Mancha. I'm going to ask you a question about this question. Thank you, ma'am. So, I'm going to ask you a question. In your view, what is education? First of all, thank you for the question, ma'am. I'm honored to answer your question. In my view, in my view, education is the thing which we get by receiving the knowledge of different things by different different areas like school and universities. We get it from different places and no, and we get it from different technologies. And also, education is the most powerful weapon which can be used to change the whole world.